Hello and welcome to the Sat on My Butt channel. I've got the Dark Knight Beard Oil from Rune Silk for review. Yes, owner and creator Daniel has brought out the Dark Knight Beard Oil because of the beard butter, the bedtime beard butter of the same scent was so very popular. I loved it, absolutely amazing. In fact, Rune Silk, up to this point, of just blown me away with every single product just amazing and it's one of those brands that i say to you if you haven't tried their product yet you are really really honestly truly missing out i'm not just saying that you gotta try them just incredible and so as i say he brought out the dark knight beard oil now then it costs 11 pound 99 for 30 mil glass bottle glass dropper style there from runesilk.com and it is a blend of grapeseed oil, organic hulgan oil, jojoba seed oil, vitamin E, sunflower oil, propylene glycol, seed buckthorn oil, oil, that was a bit of a weird one, that last time oil, oil wasn't it? But there you go. And it's got this beautiful dark, dark amber almost going into green beard oil. And I doubt we're going to get this on camera. Uh, and it is a beautiful, beautiful blend. It truly, truly is. That is sea buckthorn. I really do love that oil. Inner beard oil blend it is a really cracking, cracking oil. But it's, as I say, it's a really very lovely blend. It works well into the beard. It's just, it's, it's everything you want from a beard oil. Daniel, yet again, has created a beard oil blend that is just incredible. And I expected nothing less. This was never going to be about the quality of the beard oil. This was always going to be down to scent because I know he knows what he's doing. Now, I went back to try and find the beard butter and I rooted through the drawer of all the products and I've used it all up. That's how good it was. Because when I smell this one, I'm not so keen as I was for the beard butter. In fact, I'm a little bit... No, no, thank you. And that is because when you get a balm or a butter in a scent, getting a beard oil of the same scent, it can appear or smell very, very different. It's not going to appear different, is it? It's going to smell very different. And that is because these essential oils or fragrance oils are going to be brighter. They're going to pop out more in a beard oil than they do in those butters or balms. Don't ask me why. I haven't got a clue. And, you know, lavender... Clary Sage, Nerily Benzoin. It's very nice until a point of I go, no, it's just a bit too much for me. And I don't know what it is that is too much for me. It's just, I think I'm a bit like, if this was a little bit more muted, I might be a lot happier with it. Hence, I liked it so much in the butter. So this has got to be, well it's not always got to be, this is the very first Rune Silk Beard Care product that I've gone, oh no, not for me, thank you very much. But nonetheless, it is blended very well. You know, I can say I don't like the scent, but I can still tell that these oils used within it have been blended absolutely perfectly and very well. And as I say, I expect nothing less from Rune Silk. Go and check them out, runesilk.com. 30 mil, 11.99 for the Dark Knight Beard Oil. I do encourage you to try this brand. That For me, their balms are just absolutely amazing. The, the first one was at Revolution. Earth, I absolutely loved. And his elements range of the earth is absolutely incredible. Was incredible. Again, I've used that all up. Check them out. That is that. Don't forget to like the review. Subscribe to the old channel. I will see you next time. Take care.